Hello, my name is Nathan with EdenCAD. Today I'm going to talk to you about how a manual seat adjuster works. We're going to use SolidWorks to aid us in our explanations and analysis today. First, we will show the animation of the seatback adjuster as it would function in a car. Now that we understand the movement of the seatback adjuster, we will introduce a bit of terminology to the internal components. Now we will examine the function of the seat back without the cover. Let's take a closer look with the stabilizer plate transparent. Let's look at that again a bit slower and notice that the gears disengage each other as the lever is pulled. When the gears are completely disengaged, the radial spring causes the seat back to swing forward. As you pull the seat back to its original position, the lever swings back into its original place. Now let's look at that from the top view to understand how the parts are layered. Now we will discuss some engineering considerations if you want to design a similar system. First you want to make sure that the diametric pitch of the gears is low enough so that the seat back adjusts for the accuracy that you require of it, but the diametric pitch isn't too low so as to compromise the strength of the teeth. This may require the formulation and optimization of the governing equations using MATLAB or similar programs, depending on how critical your application is. Another area of consideration when designing a similar system is the balance between the moment arm of the lever and seat back and the strength of the springs that are being used. While there are certainly other engineering considerations when designing a similar system, such as material strength and the cost of the manufacturing process is chosen, we consider the ones discussed to be unique to this system. Thanks for watching this video. Be sure to rate it and leave comments below. And if you have ideas of what you want us to feature in our future segments, go to the description of this video and there's going to be a link in there where you can vote on new products that you want us to show how they work.